Okay guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to group the ZTE ZMAX. Here is proof that this is the ZMAX. If I go, and you can see Z970. So, first thing you're going to want to do is go and download Kingroot from the first link in the description. After that, what you're going to want to do is go download the TWRP recovery app and like root checker if you want to make sure that it's good. Now uh, since you're going to have to hit the king root multiple times I suggest going into settings apps downloaded and finding king root. And then whenever it fails to root your phone, just hit clear data and then it'll just let you start o right over again. So now that you've got all these things ready to go, you're going to want to hit King Root. It's going to open King Root. Now it's not going to show it for me because I have denied King Root access to any of my phone because it's already rooted and I don't want to mess anything up. So, there's going to be a big blue button down here that has Chinese letters and root. You're going to want to click that. There's going to be a progression kind of screen here. Once that either has kind of a face with a tear, all right, that's when you're going to want to go into to this, never mind, never mind, it didn't want to work, that's when you're going to want to go, no, no really, not going to work for me now, huh, no, this is obviously still a work in progress, uh, yeah, you're going to want to go here and hit the clear data, if it fails, if it doesn't fail or if it starts over what you're going to want to do is well you know what first off if it starts if it restarts your phone and it boots you back in go to king root see if it failed if it failed redo it keep doing that until it has kind of a blue check mark there when it has the blue check mark what you're going to want to do is go to the twrp app and hit install recovery at the top there. After you've installed the recovery, you're going to want to go to reboot recovery. Once you do that, it restarts your phone. Okay, sorry about that. I had a phone call to take. So, after it restarts your phone, it's going to boot you into TWRP. There's going to be a kind of reboot button down in this area. You're going to click that, and then over here there should be a reboot recovery, and you'll click that. Now it should ask you if you want to install Super SU. You're going to hit yes, and just let it do its thing after that. And then once you're into your phone, in theory, you should be rooted and ready. At least that worked for me. You see, it's been about a day and a half and I still have root. So, good luck. And it, I should throw this out here. This is a T-Mobile ZMAX. And it was, well, I should have uh, I should have said this earlier. To get King Root to work better, what you need to do is open some RAM intensive things like maybe a browser, your settings, get some intensive games, and that those running should help King Root get get in and everything. So good luck, and tell me how you did. If you need help, tell me in the comments or on Google Plus. And I think that's about it. See ya.